this is how I prepare a bass like fish for cooking whole. So first things first, I'm gonna scale the fish. These fish shears have a handy scaler on them, but you could use a normal scaler, a fillet knife, or even a butter knife. Grasping the fish with my off hand, I'll use my dominant hand to scrape the fish with the scaler, moving from the tail to the head. Make sure you remove all of the scales, paying close attention to the belly, back, and near the gill plates. Once you scale both sides, rinse off the fish and clear your prep area of any scales. Now we're gonna gut the fish. Find the anal vent and insert the shears, keeping pressure upwards on the belly. Make an incision right to the base of the jaw. Open up the belly cavity and wrap your fingers around the visible guts. Yank them out and discard. Now we're gonna remove the gills. With smaller fish, you can simply yank the gills out with your fingers or a pair of pliers. They can be quite sharp and abrasive though, so sometimes it's better to just snip them out with shears or a fillet knife. Gills impart bitterness to soups or stews using whole fish, and just get in the way in other preparations. It's best to remove them. Now we're gonna go around and snip off all of the fins on the fish. This streamlines the fish, making the end product look better, and it also removes any sharp spines that could get in the way of eating the fish. This part isn't totally necessary, but I would definitely remove the sharp dorsal fin, if nothing else. From here I like to rinse out the fish inside and out, or pat it clean with a paper towel. Lacking scales, guts, fins, and gills, this fish is now ready to grill, fry, sear, simmer, or braise.